Welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man V! So last time on this other weird planet out here... Um, what planet is that anyway? Because it's not... It's the moon! Wow, the moon's out there with all the other planets. That's just weird. No, that's just where the Dwarfs of Darkness and the Asians are based then. Oh. Okay, so to start it out... To start our day out, um, we actually need to go back and get Pluto's gem. So we're gonna go get that right now. Yeah, so we're gonna do that. Oh crap, I hit the wrong button and I went back to Earth! It's the B button. You have to hit the A button. I did it. Here it is. Nope, oh, right here. Oh, I gotta go down. Yep. I, I see. Since we got that deep digger, we can actually dig up blocks now. And just go, up and chunk. Eat it. And then we just go down the ladder. We gotta be careful, because there's them falling beans again. I see them. You can just slide over. I want that. I mean, you can rush coil, but... Oh um, man, look how shiny that thing is. And then you can just deep digger those two things. I would deep digger them first, and then get the energy thing. But you can just grab the gem now. Okay. Just, whoop. Yay! Up, and up once more. Grab the pea chip and the white. Slide back out, and slide up and get that energy thing, and then make your way back up and... Oh, that's terrifying. Finish the level, because I don't think this stuff comes with an exit. Wow, you made that in one felt sweep. Swoop. Yeah, I don't think there's a way for me to get out of here, sweep so... Gotta go back the long way. We did it! We got stuffs for you, Dr. Light. Would you like the stuffs? Oh, Mega Man! Now remember to scroll over and select the item. That is that. That one? Wow. Yeah. I didn't think it was going to be in the list. I figured there'd be a cutscene or something. No, he just makes it once you get it. Um, is it the A button? You have to hit the A button. It's a power generator made from the four crystals that he reversed engineered and like gotta keep in mind he's a robotics genius so eh. but this cuts all our energy weapon usage in half heck yeah so now what used to cost two costs one and what costs three costs two i think i think they rounded up if it splits even oddly yes i do want that uh, we also, also have 72 B chips so i would check the ener what's the special energy tank there's no way you're getting it with 72. 120. No. At least get some weapon energy tanks. We have one. You can get up to four, I think. So we can get two of them. I, uh, yeah, I would get two of them. I mean, I guess we're not coming back here after this. No. We're full on energy tanks. Yes. We're always going to get more energy tanks. And we're actually pretty good on lives, so... Yeah, we're nope. going to be getting more lives. As long as we don't die, Yeah, we're going to be getting a lot more and, lives. And while I would like to get that S tank, we don't have the chips for it, and we ain't farming it out, so... Besides, he'll tell you if you have one too many of them, so... Good Our luck, Mega Man. I shall need it, I guess. Off to Terra we go! To Terra Firma! Alright, Tuxedo Mask, let's do it! Oh, I get it now, Terra Firma. That ass, yo. Even though I am weak to Deep Digger, I shall put all these rocks around here you can use Deep Digger on. We never said we were smart, we said we were ancient. I'm not really sure. That seemed like it was Mega Man talking, but sometimes it's hard to tell. Yeah, I think it was basically Terra just talking. I wasn't paying attention, I was making a whip. No, the first joke. time it was Mega Man. Oh. It just didn't sound like the kind of thing that he'd say right away. One of the downsides of having so many words. How can I face my master now? Oh no, he has a master? By blowing you. Two pieces. Oh, thank God. Okay, so, um, he's weak to deep, deep Digger, so yep. grab uh, Uranus's weapon. And grab blocks, start chucking them. Yep. A chunk. 
A chunk. Wait for it, he's gonna disappear and pop up on the other side, the chunk. Crap! Jump it! Oh! I didn't, I didn't do it! It's I messed a, up! It's a flash thing! God dang it, you monster! Oh, he's dead now. You've killed him. You knocked his block off! So he's kinda hard... Like, he's not that hard, there's not a lot to him. You can, actually, you can also use the Mega Hand, too, and it does decent damage. Mm. Since that was the whole point, you got the Mega Hand. Yeah, and you even get a weapon for him. Yes. I think it's interesting that you get a weapon for the like the side, like the, the not one of the main eight. The Game Boy games, definitely with the Mega Man killers, they were the ones that gave you the odd robot master powers. Like the odd number, like you always had more than one power because you had the rush stuff and everything. But the Game Boy ones gave you like more than the eight robot masters, so which honestly was cool. So star yep. droids, they're all dead, and I don't have no idea who their master is, so there's no way that he would ever show up at all. Are you sure that's a star, Mega Man? I th do you know much about astrology? That's no moon. That's a space station with a W and a skull on it. Dang it! It was Wily the whole time. Man. <laughs> that lovable scamp. I'm going to shove my Mega Buster down his throat. I mean... <laughs> is he behind this? Oh, this is, hold up. This is my favorite line in this entire game. Oops! Oops! That was close. I mean, I can see that that was close after he teleported, but before he even teleported. And then the, oops! Like, the crap, man. My favorite one is in the fourth game. He actually shoots back at the Wily Fortress and actually detonates some of it, but he teleports back and forth to dodge some of the lasers. Hm. It's actually a pretty cool cutscene. And then there's a little shooter section where I can fly around and I can shoot guys. You can't shoot these, though. You can also dash. Because if you know anything about the, the company that worked on these, the Game Boy games, they were actually made a bunch of old sh space shooters at the beginning of the Game Boy's life cycle, so this is kind of their throwback to the whole thing. So do recall the old R-Type mantra of, we will kill you until you learn. Ah! You didn't learn. You I know. didn't. I clearly enemies, didn't learn. Enemies always appear from the bottom of the screen. Or yeah, from, from behind other, you. From other parts of the screen, so you never actually you actually kinda wanna be in the middle as much as you can. They always yeah, they appear the from kind of everywhere, but they also home in on you. Oh yeah, big gun for you. So it's difficult to stay in the middle of the screen. I mean, they wanna make a challenge, sure, but I don't know if this challenge is this challenge is a little cheap, considering dudes can just kind of show up on top of you. Also, your slice kind of weird because if you just hit A, and you hit yeah, you hit forward and oh, come oh, the holy laser crap. beams. I would say it's more like a boost. Yeah, it's not a slide. Oh, also with that one, easiest thing: go where the laser went. Go where the laser last fired. Also, I'm going to throw this out here right now, just in case something bad happens, because you're at a boss! Oh no! Uh, you can always pause the screen and use an energy tank. As far yeah, remember as that laser? three attacks, the main laser, which is its one weakness, it shoots missiles that you can shoot down. So it, mo it, shoots, a, it shoots out its big laser, and it gives you enough headway it, hand, yeah. beforehand. Just don't get anywhere near that laser, and this really isn't that hard and those four shots that always, like, try to track in on you. And it always alternates between ma major laser, not the... Yeah, like, this is it. This is the whole pattern. You've seen it all. God, what genre is major laser? I don't know. It's like, I want to say reggae, but it feels like it's more like techno reggae, with the hint and there of other genres, but... Like, biggest thing to worry about is getting hit by that laser, and it's really not hard yeah, to not get hit. Yeah, that'll take a huge hit. chunk off you. Yeah. But it's not hard to not get hit by that laser, though. It gives you a looks large like headway. It looks like it's gonna, gonna eat us. So I bet you were. I bet we're delicious. I or I'm just delicious. going to go right into its mouth myself. And now and that ends my controlling. So the controller goes to ogre. And now we're inside the Wily Star because Star Wars is really popular. I mean, hey, it's a big ol'... I like it. The Jedi Knights were always cool. I, wanna I know always why... liked the Mandalorians, though. I want to know why Mega Man suddenly thought, that's a star! 
Have you ever seen a star in your life, Mega Man? Yeah, he has. They were called Star Wars, so... And look at those guys, they got their skull heads back, so they're not even hiding the fact anymore it's widely. <laughs> oh god, I think we got this piece of crap still. Just gotta shoot him in his head and then jump over the thing. Oh. Just clip the edge of that box there. Now, we do not get a... We do not get a map in this like we do in many of the NES games as we progress through the Wily stages, but there are four Wily stages and then, like, final boss rushy thing. Um, I, forget, I forget where I was going with that. Oh, it's just one solid stage. Yeah, but it's it's treated all as one giant stage. But you still get like four sub stages, so to say. You get checkpoints along the way, so Thank heavens. That's back down where the other way would have brought us up. Did you notice we uh, broke the blocks earlier? So we could go in and take that kind of short cutty way. Had we gone the other way, we just would come up from the bottom. <gasps> and hey! That guy looks familiar! It's Anchor from Mega Man, uh, Mega Man Wy Dr. Wily's Revenge. Also yeah, called Rockman's World in Japanese because first, Super Mario Land was out. Yeah. The first of the Mega Man games on the Game Boy introduced one special boss near the end, the first of the Mega Man killers. Who are Anchor. specifically designed to kill Mega Man. Anchor, fun fact, is actually named after a specific Japanese style of singing. It's more folk singing. But, uh, it's also... No, you don't, you don't have to do anything. I know, I know. I just... Boing. Really? You're gonna... It's more fun this way. Gonna waste all our energy? Well, it's not like we need it right away. Also, nobody's speedrunning this, so... But, uh, it's specifically said in his profile that he does not like... Doesn't like foreigners just because of that ink, of the Inca style. That jerk. It's also said that, uh, some people brought it up, and I think I wanted to specifically remember this for it, but, uh, <laughs> in Mercury's profile, the guy who steals stuff from you and repurposes it himself, uh, he's a communist. Well, like, straight up, it says in the Japanese version, he's a communist. All Inker. right. The first of the Sailor Stars. He fights with a uh, reflecting kind of weapon. I can't remember what it's called. Mirror Buster. You can only hit him when he's holding his spear up like that. And he will just absorb it and use it for his attack. It was the only way to beat him, so... Yeah, but you ha you, it also hurts him, though. And it's the only way to hurt him. Yep. So even though you're giving him fuel for his attack... You have to. Uh-oh. Yeah, hold up. Almost fell down there. Yeah. So we're gonna hold it up right there. As the first of the Mega Man killers falls, we still got a whole bunch of Wily Star to go through. Yep. Until next time, everyone. I'm gonna jump up! See? I didn't say I was gonna jump down. Now I am. <laughs>